What is going on, Ronson here, and oh my gosh, I'm back with some more Dragon Ball Xenoverse information. Holy crap, they're literally releasing everything that they could in one day. My brain can't handle all this news. I'm sure you guys can, but my brain is literally going to explode with everything that they're that they're announcing today. So, let's go ahead and break down the small news first, and then we go into more of the detail stuff uh, later in the video. So, first things first, <laughs> it's actually funny, as soon as I started recording this video... This news went up, so I added it quickly to my list. But a PC slash Steam version of Dragon Ball Xenoverse has officially been confirmed. I assume it's coming out the same day when the PS3, PS4, Xbox, Xbox 360 version is coming out. But uh, it hasn't been confirmed yet as far as release. But I assume I assume it's the same day. Uh, if they decide to change up the date, I will let you know. But a PC slash Steam version of the game is coming. So get excited about that. Uh, jump up, go Super Saiyan and all that stuff. The next thing I wanted to kind of cover is the, um, the mentor system. Uh, I told you the last video that there's going to be a mentor system where you choose a mentor and then uh, they kind of stick around and teach you all the moves. Well, there's a new trailer that they premiered at TGS, which will be probably online sometime in the next uh, day or so. Probably out by the time I'm done recording this video. And this uh, is the same trailer as the one that was a minute long, but it's three minutes long instead and showcases you a lot more. Um, uh, first things first, it confirmed mutant race, mutant slash our caution race, whatever you want to call it. I mean, they kind of showed off the mutant race in the uh, in the video where they showed the developer of the game walking around the online lobby. There's like a part where they show like the Guinea Force people, Guinea Force custom created characters doing like poses. Well, the mutant race is officially confirmed because in the extended trailer, they show you playing as a Frieza style person, and then and then they also show you another spot where they show uh. A group of different Frieza style warriors, mutants, whatever you want to call it. I don't know if it's called Arcosians. Arcosian was kind of mentioned once in the anime and it kind of stuck. And it's kind of like what we call the mutant race, but it's really the mutant race, the ice race, whatever you want to call it. You can play as Frieza's race. That's what I'm trying to tell you. So that's come too. As far as the mentor system, like I was trying to tell you, the mentor system, the, the way it works is, is when you create your character, you choose one person to kind of train you. And this person sticks with you throughout the entire game and uh, they basically teach you. Everything, uh, move wise, how to, like they showed in the extended trailer. They showed, uh, I'm gonna link that by the way. If you want to see the, this extended trailer, it'll be linked in the description below. Uh, and of course, the high quality one will come out in a couple in the next, I don't know, day or so. But the, what they showed you in the trailer is is they showed like uh, TN doing the uh, solar flare, and then they flashed over to a human uh, or custom created character doing a final flash. They showed uh, Krillin throwing a destructive disc, and then it switches over to a custom character throwing a destructive disc. And that's the same thing with special beam cannon. Shoot, and then it shows uh, a custom created character shooting a special beam cannon. So essentially, uh, after you're done creating your character, you have to choose who you want to train you, and then they basically teach you their entire move set as far as super moves. I don't know about ultimate attacks, so that's going to work, uh, but I do know that you're essentially whoever you choose as your mentor is basically the move set that you will be getting in the game. Now, I don't know if there's going to be options to mix and match, because I'm sure you know some people want to do a special beam cannon, some people want to do Kamehameha, so we want both. I don't know how that's going to work, but uh, we'll find out over the next couple of days. Probably <laughs> by the time I'm done recording this video, it'll be up there. But as soon as I find out some more information, I will let you know. I mean, you see me how fast I'm pumping out this news right now. Just going left and right. And, and yeah, so again, PC version has been confirmed. The mutant freezer race has been confirmed as well. I don't know what other races they're going to confirm in the next day or so or whatever. But we just know for now uh, you can do Earthling, Saiyan, Maja, Namekian, and the Frieza race. Uh, did I miss anything? I think that's everything. Yeah. Uh, for now, those are the uh, confirmed races in this game. So, yeah. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like rating below. And if you have any questions, comments, or feedback, add that to the comment section below as well. And we'll just take it from there. Uh, I have some... I'm going to do a, actually a separate video for this. I have some news regarding the story and how the story campaign is going to work. And I'm, I decided to just do a separate video for that because it might be a little long. So I don't want to make this video too long. So I will link that in the description of this video whenever this goes up. Whenever that video goes up. Because, oh my gosh, I just can't keep up with all the information that I'm like popping out right now. But uh, be sure to look out for that and we'll just take them from there. Uh, again, my name is Ryan Style. You guys have an amazing rest of your evening slash day, whatever, wherever you are across the world. And I will see all you awesome people in the comment section below. Peace.